I've had so many requests for this one. To draw our lovely narwhal, you're going to need some plain white paper, you're going to need a pencil, an eraser, and a black pen. So let's get started. Okay, I'm gonna start off with the narwhal's head, and this is just going to be a simple little oval shape just down here. Doesn't have to be perfect, I'm just doing it lightly in pencil because we're going to erase all this later on. There we go. Next, I'm going to be drawing another oval shape just to the right hand side, which is going to be the body. Now this one overlaps the other one. I'll show you what I mean. So. There we go something like that. These are just rough guidelines so it doesn't really matter if they're perfect or not. Next I'm going to be adding the tail. So coming out from the top of here I'm going to be drawing a curved line just going up to around about there and then another curved line coming out from the bottom of this oval shape. It's going to just almost touch this one but not quite. We're then going to add the tail. So, just a curved line like that, a dip, and then another curved line, just like that. Now, I'm going to join up this oval to that oval, just with a simple line, just here. I'm going to do the same just down here, just a little line like that. Now, I'm going to add a fin coming out from here. And then another fin, just coming round here. Remember if I go too quickly, just hit pause and rewind. It's much better that you don't miss anything, so just don't worry about hitting pause. Now, I'm going to be drawing the tusk, so this is going to be coming straight up like this, just at an angle to the right. You don't have to use a ruler. There we go. Excellent, and that's our preparatory stage. Okay, so we're gonna start off with this amazing tusk. Now, I'm going to be switching to pen, but you please carry on in pencil. This is just so that you can see it better on camera. We're going to be doing a series of shapes, and they're like this. It's just a curved shape, just like that. Okay, so I'm gonna be doing that all the way down here. all the way down. They're getting ever so slightly bigger, the closer I get to the head. And a little bit longer. There we go. Like this. Until we hit the head area. Just like that. I'm just gonna fill in the gaps. the end bit. There we go. Now for the head. We're going to be drawing the mouth, so just following this oval shape across, we're then going to cut inwards like that. And then we can add the little mouth. Just like that. A little happy face. There we go. And then from this side, I'm going to carry on with the head all the way down and round to there. I'm then going to add the eye, which is just over here. Just a little tiny weeny little eye, just like that. So narwhals can live up to 50 years, although the average is usually between 30 and 40 years. Right, so I'm then going to carry on with this line all the way around, all the way around, so we get to there. Now we're going to carry it on and then we're just going to draw the tail here. There we go. Just like that. And then we're going to go back round and then for the belly and then the flipper here. Yeah. 
So the tusks are actually a tooth, but you didn't know that. And they usually only form on the males, not on the females, although it's not impossible for them to form on the females. So there we go. And they can actually grow up to 10 feet long. That's incredible. There we go. Excellent. So if you haven't gone over it in pen already, go over it in pen, and then we're going to erase all the pencil marks. Right, now to add some details. So we're going to be adding some details to the tail, just here. Just a line coming down like that. I'm then going to be adding a little bit of shadow just underneath here. So I'm just going to colour that in black. And then round here as well. So what's quite interesting is that narwhals change colour with age. So newborns are speckled blue-grey. Then in their teens, they're blue-black. And then adults are just speckled grey. And then as, when they become really old, then they're white. So you can tell the age of the narwhal just by looking at it. I'm going to carry on the shadow all the way down here. And a little bit of shadow underneath here. Okay, I'm then going to add shadow to just one side. Just there. There we go. I'm now going to add more shadow to the bottom, but curved lines. I'm going to carry it on all the way along the bottom, not on the fin as you can see here. Then my curved lines are kind of changing direction here. They're curved that way on this side and now they're curved this way on this side. All the way up to the top. make it a little bit darker I'm going over some of them there we go now a little bit of shadow on this fin along the bottom and on this one there we go going to go over the shadow here as well. And then last but not least a tiny bit there. So there we have our finished narwhal drawing. I do hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, then I have lots of other sea creatures to choose from, so just hit the playlist here. And I hope to see you on the next one. Don't forget to hit like and subscribe. Thanks, bye-bye.